Good evening everyone. First of all, Ayubhuwan from the Jewel of Indian Ocean. I am on a 10 day trip here in the beautiful island nation of Sri Lanka. I am here today in Merissa which is located deep down the southernmost part of Sri Lanka. And from here I will be moving up north to Gaul and then to Colombo. So today is my first day here in Sri Lanka and I am here in Merissa. I came across this place called Ceylon Curry House. Ceylon was formerly known as the, the, the previous name of Sri Lanka was Ceylon. So the name of this restaurant is called Ceylon Curry House. So I'm here to try the different curries. The, I know they do have that authenticity of curries. While I, while I was doing my research, this was the most highly recommended place here in Merissa, Sri Lanka. So, I'm gonna take you guys on a beautiful curry tour. Stay tuned till the end of the video. Also stay tuned for more Sri Lankan videos. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe to my channel. Make sure to like, comment, share. And see you guys around. Bohoma Estuti. Thank you so much. Your name? Tilina. Tilina. Yeah. Nice to meet you, Tilina. Nice to meet you, sir. Whoa, look at this. So, I've got a lot of curries. Five different curries with rice and black pork curry. Let's dig in. So I have, as I showed earlier, I have five different curries. And look how beautiful it is. This is coconut shell. The shell of the coconut, they have, you know, they, they have worked on it. They have made it nice, fine, and used it as a utensil, typical, uh, Asian way of uh, preserving things and authenticity. So yes, again, this is mango curry, beans, coconut sambal. This is something I always wanted to try. This is banana flower curry in coconut milk. This is black tuna curry. I've never had tuna curry. I've eaten uh, raw tuna or uh, 
let's say sashimi, makis or ceviches but a tuna curry is a first for me so I'm excited to try this and the main star of the dish is black pork curry again you see this utensil it's clay pot you can see the pork I ordered it uh, spicy just to I was crazy so let's see how spicy it is and again papadums and brown rice it's very hot I'm sweating so I really don't know where I can, where I have to start but I will go for the main dish the black pork curry Mix it with the rice. Cheers. First ever Sri Lankan meal in Sri Lanka in Merissa. Black pork. Cheers. Spicy. It's very peppery and I ordered it spicy just to try something different but the pork is soft the curry comes comes up very very well and delicious spicy it's burning my lips but the pork is soft cooked really well and delicious this has got uh, onion, garlic, curry leaves and they have Sri Lankan black curry powder so a secret blend again and a delicious one it's very spicy I'm going to cool it down with a sip of beer now I'm going for the Mango curry. It's got pieces of mango. I've never been excited, uh, this excited for a curry. Because Sri Lanka does have uh, some of the authentic uh, recipes for curries. Cheers. Sour too. The mango is sweet and sour and it's so soft. I was expecting it to be sour but there's a sweetness to it. I'll have a mango on its own. Delicious man. Very delicious. Soft. It just melted in my mouth. And the tanginess delicious I love this one again it's peppery it's this has got uh, the basic curry flavors mango skin for something that I've never tried tuna curry look at that massive chunk of tuna I'll take some of the curry sauce go to the rice look at that tuna it's it's soft it's it's it just breaks apart so I'll take a tuna, a piece of tuna cheers mm. 
I see again. But the saltiness, it's a bit salty. It's naturally from the tuna. And it's cooked really well. It just falls apart, melts in your mouth. I've never had a curry before. This is my first time in, uh, in Sri Lanka. A tuna curry. Delicious. I'll try some uh, coconut sambal. Sambal is basically condiments from Asia. I've eaten this in uh, Indonesia before. First time trying Sri Lankan sambal. This has got onion, tomatoes. The coconut is roasted. I'll try the sambal on its own. Cheers. Mm. It's it's the flavor. It has it has that uh, nutty flavor which comes from the coconut but it's sour I believe it's having uh, lemon juice and the tomato adds that sourness too also the onions makes it more crunchy the texture from the onion raw onion I'll try some with rice Just the sourness and the spiciness, but delicious. A very good condiment and very easy to make. Some onions, chilies, tomatoes, roast the coconut, and add some touch of lime juice. And lastly, I'll try the banana blossoms, banana flowers. They said here. There's coconut milk and I really love the, the coconut shell. Let's see if I can get some uh, home. Mix it well with the rice. light it's not as spicy as uh, the pork the tuna and the mango this is very light because it has coconut milk it tones down the kick but the flowers are sweet naturally they're very sweet delicious again I've never had this uh, banana blossom curry it's a first for me again so I like it I really love it and this <laughs> This is a combination of five different curries. Comes with rice and carpet. You get to taste every single thing and how authentic it tastes. You can choose the spice level. You want it spicy, non-spicy. I wanted it spicy. I got it. You can see it. I'm sweating. Plus it's very humid here. done their curry as well highly recommended place that's how I came to know while I was doing my <coughs> while I was doing my research that this is a must play must try place so I'm here delicious and number one Sri Lankan beer Total bill came up to 5775 uh, Sri Lankan rupees. So you can see the breakdown. 
they also have a service charge 10 percent which is which is around uh, 525 rupees so when i convert it uh, it comes up to 17 uh, us dollars uh, in indian rupees it comes up to around 1400 1500 rupees and in dirhams it comes up to 65 dirhams so which is a good deal because I just wanted to try the authenticity. I didn't really go into the prices. I wanted to try curries when in Sri Lanka. Just go as deep as possible. Get the spice, get that pork, get that everything authentic Ceylonese uh, dishes. So overall this is up to $15, uh, $17. So that's it uh, from this video for now. Please stay tuned for more of uh, Sri Lankan videos and if you haven't subscribed please do subscribe to my channel see you guys around